Well, here's what we're looking at on these mustard greens. I mean, they probably been in the ground probably about 50 days. I mean, what you're looking at is probably about a dollar worth of seeds. And out of the greens that we're looking at, that if I get a little bit colder weather to kind of kill the bugs a little bit because I don't use insecticides or nothing on them. I like them natural, but I like when I sell them to people, I like for them to be in good form condition. So I got to work with nature on doing that. And from 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 what you're looking at, as far as me planting them to sell them to make a few dollars, and between what I done gave my neighbors and stuff, I mean, you take, for example, you take, for example, once, once the green get to this size right here, once I thin these out, then I won't, I, I won't be pulling them up like what I'm doing now by the root cause I'm thinning them. You would start what you call cropping them. And that's just breaking them off like that. And that's the way most people want them. That's the way they come out the store without the root part. All right, we're gonna move on over. But then giving it, like I said, nature, the rats and the rabbits and stuff got to eat the soul. They done set me back on these, so they might restart again sooner or later. Come on down and hit this. That's lettuce, you say? That's, that's head lettuce. Okay. Why you got it fenced in? Keep chickens off of it? Well, keep everything off of oh, okay. it and then try to protect it. Oh, I mean, rabbits it's, it's, too, real, huh? it's, it's real delicate a plant to grow. Oh, okay. All right. In this little area, as you can see, I got my cabbage plants, but again, I'll say I got to work with nature and the creatures in the country dealing with nature. They done ate what they wanted, so hopefully, they didn't cut them down by the root, so hopefully they'll come back and I can harvest the rest. Now over here, we got a little turnip patch, which, you know, you plant them thick. I didn't intend to plant them that thick, but it is what it is. They're growing good. But once I thin them out good, like I've been doing, and a lot of people's been eating them like they is, thinning them out without the bottoms on them. But once I get them thinned out, then basically you won't have very much top green. You will have more turnip bottoms. Okay, okay. And how old are these? Same 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 these, age? Yeah, these greens these greens is probably about sixty days old. This probably about a couple of months from planting to where we at now. We're looking at about sixty days. That's my old water well years ago. Living back here in the country, it don't look like it's got no water in it. 